How to check if voltage stabilizer is working? While it's important to be aware of your stabilizer's health, certain checks are best left to qualified professionals due to the potential dangers involved. However, here are some basic observations and checks you can perform, keeping safety in mind. Basic observations. Indicator lights. Many stabilizers have indicator lights that display the status of the input and output voltages. Consult your stabilizer's manual to understand the meaning of each light. If a light indicates abnormal voltage, it's best to seek professional help. Physical condition. Look for any visible signs of damage on the stabilizer's body, like burn marks or loose wires. If you notice anything unusual, avoid using the stabilizer and consult a qualified electrician. Safe checks. Always consult your manual first. Input voltage check. Optional some stabilizers have a switch or meter allowing you to check the incoming voltage. If available, compare it to the expected voltage in your region, usually found online or through your electricity provider. A significant deviation from the expected range might indicate an issue with the grid or the stabilizer itself. However, never touch electrical components while the stabilizer is plugged in. Output voltage check. With caution if your stabilizer has built-in voltage meters, you can carefully observe the output voltage while ensuring all connected devices are turned off. Compare it to the manufacturer's specifications. A significant difference might indicate a problem. Remember, even with seemingly low voltage readings, always prioritize safety and seek professional help if unsure. Important safety note. It's crucial to emphasize that working with electrical components can be dangerous if not done correctly. If you are unsure about any aspect of checking your voltage stabilizer, always err on the side of caution and consult a qualified electrician. They can perform a thorough and safe inspection to ensure your stabilizer is functioning properly.